Now to a story you'll see only on CBS2. A local baby is being called a true miracle because he weighed less than a pint of milk when he was born yesterday. CBS2 Inland Empire reporter Crystal Cruz has the story from Apple Valley. This is one tiny baby weighing just 14 ounces on a ventilator fighting to survive. Oh, it's, he's, he's only 10 inches long, so maybe from like here to here. James Mays and his wife Carrie welcomed their son Declan into the world on Tuesday following an umbilical cord prolapse. That's when the cord makes an appearance before baby. Declan was born here at St. Mary Medical Center in Apple Valley. He was born at 22 weeks. That's months ahead of his September due date. It was a choice between me and my wife if we wanted to try to save him or not. Uh, and we decided that we wanted to try to save him, so they rushed her back for a C-section. The couple wanted to give their son a micro preemie, seen in this photo wearing dad's wedding ring, a shot because last year their daughter died at 22 weeks. If he's a fighter, you know, we want him to fight and make his own decisions. So it, it's rough just being able to just sit there at his bedside and pretty much whisper. Mays, who's in the Army stationed in Virginia, flew in for the medical emergency. He's hoping his son's story will give hope to other parents in their same boat. A baby can be saved if you have a doctor that you know, is willing to do what he has to do. Um, and we have a great doctor, you know, and he's doing everything he possibly can for our son. His wife hopes to go home tomorrow, but they'll spend many months visiting their son here at the NICU. Also, according to the Guinness Book of World Records, the smallest baby ever born was a little more than nine ounces. Reporting live in Apple Valley tonight, I'm Crystal Cruz, CBS 2 News.